the Wake Forest football team is going to flop. Trust me, it's a good thing. You have to see it. That's coming up. But first, more well-deserved recognition for the Miami Hurricanes basketball team. I'm Jeff Fischel. It's Friday, April 5th. This is the ACC Now. Jim Laranega is the Associated Press Coach of the Year. Great pick. He led the Canes to their first ACC regular season and conference tourney titles, then got them to the Sweet 16 for just the second time in school history. Baseball this weekend, number one Carolina hosts Maryland. Baseball America just named Tar Heels ace Kent Emanuel a midseason All-American. The eighth-ranked Seminoles take on Sunshine State rivals, the Hurricanes. Georgia Tech at Duke, Virginia Tech and NC State, Clemson, BC, and the Cavs visit Wake Forest. Baseball America also named Virginia coach Brian O'Connor the midseason coach of the year. The Monday night game will be on ESPNU. We saw Duke's Nick McCrory win Olympic bronze last summer, so it's no surprise he's been named the ACC Men's Diver of the Year. McCrory won a national title on the platform. The Women's Diver of the Year is Miami's Kara McCormick, and two Tar Heels swept the top swimming honors. Senior Tom Luxinger is the Men's Swimmer of the Year. Carrie Blaylock is the Women's. And speaking of diving, you have to check this out. Wake Forest football coach Jim Grobe Gave his players a little break between spring practices. Check out Nikita Whitlock. <laughs> now, Nikita is not the only one. To see more, check out the ACC Digital Network a little later. And for our final closing note, today is the 20th anniversary of Dean Smith's final national championship at North Carolina. The Tar Heels beat Michigan's Fab Five 77-71. Can you name the starting five for North Carolina? If you know the answer, tweet me, at Jeff Fischel. I'll tweet out the answer a little later in the day. That's the ACC Now. You're watching the ACC Digital Network, brought to you by Ruby Tuesday. <laughs>